Good morning, you guys. It is 6.52 a.m. I'm about to leave for Orange Theory. It's 35 degrees outside and snowing, so I'm a little stressed. It's March 7th, so it's like almost spring. It hasn't been like snowing, snowing in a while, so we're gonna make it through. <laughs> Happy Monday. <laughs> also, hi, I'm Lucia. Welcome back to my channel. Yay. I'm insanely bundled up. <laughs> Let's do this. I lifted the mask mandate, so I can't wear a mask anymore. I mean, I could wear a mask, but instead of using a mask to like warm my face, I'm using this scarf. <laughs> this is hell, I'm so wet. <laughs> Target right now. The workout was crazy. <laughs> I ran a mile and a half without stopping, which I'm really proud of myself for because I'm really bad at doing that. But I'll catch up with you guys and give you my little haul when I get my performance. Alright, you guys, I'm back. Cheers. Protein shake. Okay, this is my Target haul. They didn't have blue corn chips, so I had to get the white ones, which was kind of annoying, but that's okay. I'm just out of this moisturizer. I always get the Target brand because it's like five bucks cheaper than the Aveeno brand. Some blueberries just to restock on those. Vanilla extract, Bonnie Greek yogurt. This is also for my overnight oats. Tied to go. I literally stain my shirts every every single day, so I figured I should invest in this. An eyebrow brush, it's been a while since I replaced mine and it was getting gross. Candle lighters, I tried that electric candle lighter from Amazon and it's just not doing it for me, it kind of stresses me out. And then actual stain remover when I'm home. So that's it. I forgot that I made my bed and just walked in here and it's made. Such a good feeling. I always feel so productive when I come back on Mondays because I've already worked out, gone to Target. I just love going to Target on Mondays because it's on the way back from Orange Theory, so it's easy to just get it all done. Feeling ready for the week, although it's 9 a.m. and I still need to shower before I log on to work, so I am running a little bit late. I'm gonna hop in the shower, wash my hair. I have a lot of hairspray in it because I went to this holiday party for my boyfriend's company on Saturday and I curled my hair, so there's still- Oh shit, my hairspray in it. So it's kind of gross. Cheers, time to hydrate. It's 9.26 now, and I'm just now logging on to the work day. I wish I could say this is a rare occurrence, but honestly. This is normally the vibe. Either way, I make sure I get all my stuff done, so it's not a big deal. I just hate feeling behind, and like people have been emailing me, and I haven't been responding and stuff. So I'm gonna get all my shit together. Still in my robe. I washed my hair. I've been using the purple bedhead toning shampoo. It's been a lifesaver. My hair used to be so brassy, and now I feel like it looks like I just got it done yesterday. Yeah, I was planning on Monday, start of the week, going and getting my free Starbucks drink. I have 150 stars. I don't know when they expire. Let me know down below when Starbucks rewards expire. I feel like it's so confusing. Like just, I never know. I don't want to miss out on the opportunity, but also it's snowing. I don't really want to go to Starbucks today. I'm also like already behind. I'm gonna save that maybe for Wednesday when I'm going into the office. But on Mondays, I love just like going through all my emails. I have like 44 emails I have to read right now. And then I love listening to the Real Real podcast by Natalie Barbu on Mondays because it comes out on Mondays. And I don't know, I just love her. She's so natural. She's such an entrepreneur. She's really inspiring. And the episode today is leading with vulnerability and trusting your instincts which I feel like is a great mantra for the week. So I'm just gonna get my shit together, write down everything I need to do in my planner. I'm also gonna try to do a little bit of like a gratitude journaling and stuff. I'm honestly feeling great. I got nine and a half hours of sleep last night. Let's do this. I got the morning lineup, my coffee. Yes, it says world's best grandpa ever. I just thought it was funny. And water, yay. It looks a little snowy. It was literally 70 degrees on Saturday, so I was in that mindset, <laughs> feeling great about spring and everything. And of course it snows today, but. I mean, it is Chicago. <laughs> okay, I changed, so I'm finally feeling a little bit more put together and ready to finally start tackling on the work day. This is a set from Express. It's velour. I love it. It's super cozy. I always just kind of like tuck it into my bralette to make it a crop top because it's a little too big for me. And these are my Elk slippers that I am obsessed with. I literally just wear them 24 seven when I work from home. <laughs> Being able to get just like random household chores done throughout the day is probably the best part of working from home. You don't have to worry about getting everything done on Sunday. If I don't get everything completely finished from my Sunday reset, I know I can just finish it on Monday. All right, it's grind time. <laughs> So 
I'm about to take a quick break from work because my therapist is about to call me. I'm so anxious, low key. I'm just excited to talk it all out. Hopefully, I'll feel better afterwards. I'm done with therapy. <laughs> Feeling like a new woman. I always do this thing. It's like 12:50 now, where I'm still eating the breakfast I made at 9 a.m. for myself. I'm gonna try to finish this up. Grind out maybe like an hour of work. We'll see how it goes, and then make lunch. I can't believe it's already 1 p.m., but I have to remind myself that I've done a lot today. <laughs> I worked out, cleaning, kind of therapy, a lot of stuff. It's 2.23, I'm now ready for lunch. I think I'm gonna make an everything bagel with some fried eggs. Got my bagel ready. I love it. It's so yummy. I can't wait to eat it. Today, unfortunately, is just the type of day where I'm gonna have to eat while doing work. My days are always like bam, 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 meetings and stuff. One of my tricks for working from home is to always have a candle. This is the one I have going on right now. I just try, since I'm cooped up in my room most of the day when I'm working from home, I try to keep a candle so it smells really nice in here, especially when I'm eating or else it gets really stinky. I burned through a Target candle a week though, which is kind of bad. I also just like literally love my room. Love of all the decorations and I'm getting so excited so I'm moving in like August but it feels closer than further if that makes sense just so excited to be able to make like the whole whole apartment a nice aesthetic. We didn't really invest anything into making the apartment like look nice or be like homey in any way. We just kind of like threw some shit together. I can't wait to like pull out my little mini interior designer that I secretly wanted to be when I was like 10. So good. Just kiss. I have like a bunch of trips coming up, which is very exciting. But I'm going to New York next weekend just to like visit some friends and have a fun weekend. I'm so excited to just get out of Chicago for a second. And then later in April, I'm going to Coachella. Dream about every day. I just ordered like all my clothes. I'll be making a video about like everything I'm wearing. Anyways, okay, I'm gonna have an Olipop. They sent me like a bunch of different flavors. So this is the strawberry vanilla. It's basically like a healthier alternative to soda, but it's still really good. Okay guys, the work day is basically over. I'm going to my boyfriend's tonight, as I mentioned. He lives in Wicker Park, and it's honestly kind of nice to get out of this neighborhood and have like a second home. <laughs> yeah, so I'm just packing my bag. I actually have like double of all my skincare items over at his place, but just like a few things I needed to bring. And I also grabbed some eye patches and a pore strip, so I'm gonna do that tonight, which is exciting. I just keep this jade roller in the freezer. I also have a gua sha, but I honestly haven't learned the whole art of the gua sha yet. Still working on that. Packing my laptop, planner, wallet, my toiletries. And I also always come back in the morning pretty much. Like I'm not going to work from home there tomorrow morning. I'll come back in the morning. So I don't need to bring like everything for work from home, which is really nice. All right, I'm headed out to my boyfriend's waiting for the elevator. I take the blue line over. It's going to be cold outside. <laughs> To Vicente's. There's a fire, there's a fire. Hey, vlog. We're making pasta, bonza, classic. Oh, we're gonna watch a movie. What is it? We're it's watching called Interstellar. Interstellar? Yep. It's with Leonardo DiCaprio. No, it's not. Oh, no, that's the other one we were thinking about watching. What is it? Inception. Christopher Nolan. It's Christopher Nolan directed, and it's Matthew McConaughey who stars. Oh, another good actor. Let dinner be served. Yum. Okay, update. We watched about an hour of the movie and it's so good. I love it. It's really interesting. First hour was really just like setting up the plot, but it was still really good. We're gonna finish it. Probably not all of it tonight, but watch the rest another day. But totally recommend. All right, you guys, I'm in my boyfriend's bathroom. It's now like 10 p.m. I'm just doing skincare. I'm gonna put on some eye patches. I've never actually put them on at nighttime, even though it says on the packaging that it's best to be worn before resting. I'm gonna try it and see if like tomorrow morning my eyes will be less puffy because of it. Like, I don't know. Or maybe it's just supposed to relax you. Little nightly skincare. We didn't finish the movie. I've just been working on like a lot of TikTok stuff I have to do. Coordinating with brands and stuff. Since I have a nine to five, do all that like at night time. So my weeks are normally pretty busy, but it's really fun. And I'm grateful that brands are reaching out to me. All right, <laughs> this is my look. We love to see it. That's pretty much the entire day. Thanks for watching. Be sure to subscribe so you don't miss my next video. Every Tuesday, I'm back on my weekly upload, which is very exciting. I've been promising for a while that I'm gonna upload every Tuesday, but now it's actually happening. All right, good night, you guys. Much love. I will see you in my next video.